Do you really think it's gonna explode? Hey, we've been what's there. up? We've been, what's up, you guys? We're back. We haven't done the video for a while. Uh, we we've, we've been busy. Super busy. A lot of things going on in yep. school, starting stuff, doing things. I got married while we were gone. That was kind of yeah, cool. Yeah, I had a couple of babies. Since and you then. had a couple. Of babies. I haven't, but my wife has. So today we're doing Ulver's new televisions. We thought it'd be kind of fun. We always wondered what was inside these old TVs. So we've got a good lineup here. Let's show them really quick. Why don't you explain what we got here? Yeah. So the first one here we have from probably the I don't know 80s, 70s. Yeah, early 80s, late it's 70s. It's a General Electric premium TV. So this one is from the I think the late 90s, early 2000s. This one is run off of. Projection, I think, something like that. Uh, anyway, this was a really big one. It's super heavy. It took us forever to get it out of where we got it from. It's super heavy. Like it took six people. You can hardly see. What yeah, if we turn the lights off, you can see what we're playing here. <laughs> a creepy cat. It's, a, it's oh, it's not it's, it's, it's pig. But once you turn the lights on, it's really it's hard like, to see anything. To see. Next, we have this one. This is the early 2000s as well a little bit earlier than this one a little bit newer than this one i should say it's and a little bit. it's brighter for sure it's brighter that's what i'm trying to say it's brighter it looks it's still as long as this one because it has to project so this one's plasma which it's so heavy we're talking heavy heavy yeah this one's a heavy hitter for sure i mean not as heavy as those two but it's heavy it's got a good rock to it's it. got a good rock to it and then we have this one that we this one this one got hit with something got hit with something but it's but probably it's, this yeah. year, last year's model. This is a it's LCD. It's the Roku TV. Well, let's bust into them. We hate to tear into old stuff, but none of these work properly. So we felt yeah. okay about just destroying all of them to find out what makes them tick, you know? What makes these tick? Hey, that screen fixed itself. Oh, nice. Beautiful. So, okay. Okay, so okay. here we go with the first one. Josh is going to tear into it a little bit. Show you the back side. We got a few dials here. The front, we've got the tuner dial, tunes into the stations, and this is the on, pull it to turn it on, and it's the volume. This changes the vertical and the brightness control. And uh, pretty neat, General Electric. It's got a built-in speaker system down here. So we're about ready to bust in. Check that out. Wow. So here's the back of this tube TV. So they call it a tube TV because these, you can just pull these out. These little tubes. Man, this is how all the electronics work. So this is why they call it the boop tube. Right? And they got one right here too. This is the main one. Six, seven. It's pretty incredible. Eight, nine, ten. There's like 12 or 13 tubes in this TV. Yeah, there's a tube right there. Some oh, there's, little two, tubes there's up some up here. there too. Check that out. There's some tubes up there in the top. It's just funky. I used to have tube testers just at the store. And it just had a big circle. And it could fit all different types of tubes. And the TV stopped working. You'd take your tubes in, test the tubes, <laughs> and see if they worked. Yep, pretty much. And then you'd replace them. It comes right off. Whoa! What? Look at that! Look at that! Check that out! You look at be careful. That. Looks like the. I must keep it grounded. <laughs> Who knows what that is? It's so interesting. But this is glass too. Yeah. This whole thing is glass. It's just a big bunch of glass. Look at them guts. Dude, there's the beast. Dude, that's crazy. All we gotta do is take these two things off. What to do with this? Oh. Gotta get into it somehow. How? We do it. They might explode. Do they explode? I heard that somewhere. You did? But they just freaking... Really? It's a vacuum. So it, it technically implodes. Right? It's a vacuum tube. What do you think? Do you really think it's gonna explode? I think it really might. Fetch. 
It's a good thing David read up on these vacuum tubes because literally this thing exploded. exploded. There's not much left. There's the Look very how end of the tube. There's the tube. Look how fat this glass is though. Look at that. This is the, you can see how it's sharp, but it's not focusing very well. It's pretty thick glass though, like yeah, that one right there. It's a thick sucker. Thick. Yeah, let's go on to TV too. <laughs> this is the projection oh, TV. Shoot. This is particle board that's lining the whole thing. Big, big case of particle wood. We don't know what we're gonna find in here, but we hope it's awesome. Okay. okay, there's first one. This guy. First look. Here's all the, the circuit boards. There's a lot of stuff going on in here. That's really interesting actually. So this is what projects up into the TV yeah, thing. This. Yeah, let's turn this down. Let's just put the front down. It's heavy though. So be careful. So, it's straight up just to... Yeah, so th those three are pointed backwards, so those shoot up to that. This is, a, this is a mirror. It hits those, and that just expands the projection. Literally onto the screen. It shows it on here. That is... So you're essentially like looking at a mirror. Because all those projectors are pointing backwards, and they're just reflecting it. It's kind of fun. So there's really nothing to it. So it's got three layers. It's got plastic, more plastic, and more plastic. And more plastic. Incredible. But it's just, there's nothing. And then look, you can see the mirror. There's really nothing to it though. The mirror is just putting it to ground. There's, you just got that mirror. There's the mirror. Dude, that's a good mirror. Look at that mirror. I look skinny in that mirror. Isn't that kind of funky? It literally just projects off this mirror. Hey guys, it's me. That's interesting. Because now, now you just, I mean, you put up a screen and you set up a projector. You project it on the screen. It was just an internal projection. It's pretty neat, but heavy. <laughs> <laughs> we took this front off first real quick. Uh, some pretty interesting things going on down there. Triple projector. Connecting so, into so our projectors. What happens is it's projecting the same thing, just in, in three different colors. Three different colors. So, so we're gonna close. put this back on and see what it looks like. You look close though. Look, you can see the actual movie in each color. In each color. It's freaking it's nutty. Yeah, so you can only see it projected onto the thing. So, you, so yeah, you can't see it. Gives us our three colors. Cool man. Well on to the next one, right? Okay, so here we open this one. It's a lot newer. Basically the same, they're basically employing the same techniques. So technology really hadn't changed the that much, tube. right? From the 80s or whenever. To what is this, the 2005? They're using the same freaking They're using the two, crazy thing. but they have less tubes. The other one had like 10 Yeah, this one's obviously, tubes. they just, everything's a lot more compact. No tubes except for the main. Except for the main tube. Cathode ray tube, which is here. But I'll tell you what, this thing will blow. But we don't want to do what we did last time because this thing will just explode. So. We're just basically showing you that not a ton happened, but a little bit did. So this next one is the old plasma. Plasma screen. Plasma screen, we're gonna just get it. Super heavy. Not as, uh, not as thick. They've gotten rid of the tubes completely, obviously. And uh, so everything runs the picture and then it looks like it puts them into these. These are all the way out, and those wrap around into the plasma. High voltage hot surface, I'll tell it. Yeah, so as so we took off the front, which plastic. is just a piece of glass, or plastic. Plastic covering. And covering then you can see, I'm trying to get macro here with it. That's crazy. Innovative design that they've done. And so I got this white stuff, and that's where these, that's where all of these that come in the sides. Are they going in the white? They come into that white thing. So interesting. Just hack at it. It's like a kind of a lead substance. Really? There's two layers of this glass. Oh, 
Okay. He's hacking away so at there's it. There's a layer of this. That's which that must be the plasma. It smells like sulfur. Really? Or something terrible. <laughs> the plasma screen is basically glass, layers of I don't know what they call that. Oh, but electric electric uh, things, electrodes, <laughs> and then another layer of glass, <laughs> then a layer of layer of poop smelling swamp. <laughs> It smells like swamp poop. And then behind that is just another layer of metal. Final TV, eh? Okay, the final television set. This guy. Okay, so we opened up part of this one. There's not much to it. A lot less electronics, they're just a lot smaller. It's kind of crazy. We're gonna try to dig into this a little bit more. There you go, it just pops right off. Ooh. Just gotta know what you're doing. Whoa. Oh, this. Whoa! That's just. This is. This is the newest screen. So this just pops off. So there's the connections. Oh, so down it's there. got the connections down at the bottom. See those green? Little green lines. And they're going into this, which means this <laughs> is the LED, right? Yeah. And then just a. This is literally just paper. It's just There's like white paper, and plastic behind it, a white background, and a little tiny piece of foam. Probably put my wallet in there. So, so that's oh, pretty much check it. Check that out. It just comes right off. There's really nothing to it. This is it. This one was broken, so you can see it's got some cracks in the screen. But yeah, it this just reads. This is glass, right? It just reads through what the bottom. This is like, it's. There's two plastic things. Let's break this in half. Okay, let's break it in half. Let's see what the diode looks like. Huh? Yep. <laughs> that's what I thought. More plastic. It's just a few layers Weird. of plastic. Like, what, like this is but it. That's right got here. that. That's got that. Uh, that electronic. And it's wet. And the LEDs in there. And it's very wet. So it's got a wetness factor. That helps. <laughs> That's crazy, dude. That's just crazy how this can... Like, so there, there we have the full spectrum. We've got newest. That was nasty. I'm scared of that one. <laughs> the projection with the cool... Which was pretty sweet. Projectors in there. And the old one. And that old one that's in a heap on the floor. Here you have it. We, uh, we came. Saw. You saw we conquered. Make sure you guys, uh, thanks for dialing in. Make sure to like, subscribe, share. Let us know if there's any other cool old versus new things you'd like to see. And uh, we'll try and get her done. God bless okay. America. God bless the world. Peace.